So over here, you can see that I have a Google Sheet with dates right here and then sales and expenses and income details right here. So if you want to show this out in a time graph format, then you can go to Data Studio right here. And over here, you can see that I just created a new data uh, studio file right here that is a report you can select google seat right here and select out company sales example from over here you don't see it here then you can go around and click from open open from google drive link right here as well so you can see that there's company sales the example right here which i can select and then from over here as well i can go around and add in the data so once i do that what happens is that um the data will get added to report as you click on add to report right here. So I don't want uh, this, but I want a timeline. So I'm just going to delete this, click on add a chart right here, and then click on the time, um, uh, let's say chart right here. So once I do that, what happens is you see a straight line right now because the uh, uh, metric right here is the record count. We don't want the record count, but the income right here. So once I do that, what happens, you see the income level rise just like this. You can also add in multiple things like you can go for expenses right here. So there's two um, right there and you can go around over here and let's say you want sales as well. So I'm just going to go around with sales right here and you can see the metric right here and it is in a steady rise once you uh, go around over there. So over here, you can see that you can go around and then uh, change out the style over here as well. So if you were to go around into style, then you can go for bars right here, as you can see for certain lines right here and change around how you want it. So there's left and right, as you can see right here, there's uh, go around with bars for certain things right here. As you can see, there's line over here as well. And you can change around the colors over here for the line graphs as well. And that is how you can add in line graphs to see a change in certain period of time inside of uh, the uh, inside of the Google Data um, uh, Studio right here. And as you hover over, you can also see the details for a particular point in time, as you can see. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.